Okay, so you guys been infected with this FBI money pack. It's a complete scam. It's basically classified as a ransomware. Um, it's really, uh, it's, it's pretty easy to remove, but uh, a lot of people are uh, having issues like going in safe mode and stuff like that. So I'm going to show you what this is going to work for most of you, okay? This is the easiest and foremost thing that you, the first most thing you want to do, okay? Basically what you want to do is you want to do a system restore to a previous point before you got infected with this uh, FBI uh, money pack. Now, doing a system restore, that's not going to delete any of your like uh, your files, your, your videos, your photos, your documents. It's just going to basically make your computer as if it was um, at that certain restore point. And um, it, to get into it, like a lot of your computers are pretty much like locked. You can't even do anything. You can't get into save mode and whatnot. However, or you can't even get into save mode with networking. It, and it doesn't matter because what we're going to do is we're going to go into... Um, safe mode with command prompt and then what we're going to do is we're going to uh, access the exe file to bring up the restore points so uh, follow along and um, hopefully this will be off your computer shortly what we do is we need to boot the computer into um, windows advanced options so i'm going to go ahead and re restart the computer now Restart now. If you if your computer is not restarting, uh, just ho just hold down the power button or just go ahead and unplug it, and uh, then start your computer back up. And once it starts like booting up, what we want to do is keep pressing the F8 key again to get into the um, the uh, Windows Advanced Options. So go ahead and start doing this now. If you have Windows 8, it's a different way you have to do it. Look on the bottom. Uh, the description and I'll have a link there how to access that okay that should be good okay here we go okay so what we need to do guys we need to go I mean for for a lot of you this is not going to work safe was uh, the original safe mode is not going to work safe mode where networking is not going to work however we should be able to get in this way safe mode with command prompt go ahead and click on enter let this load up once it's done loading um, we'll have to like log in using our uh, administrator name or the name that has administrator privileges. Okay, now it brought us to this screen here. I'm going to log in. And I'm using, as you can see on the bottom, I'm using a Windows 7 Ultimate. Okay, and then we'll go back to this command prompt. Okay, now you can see mine here says uh, Windows System 32. Okay, now this is what we gotta do, okay? For for those that have like a Windows 7 and above, and, and what we're gonna do here is we're going to use the exe file to execute the uh, the, the, the uh, system restore. And the file is this, it's R-S-T-R-U-I dot E-X-E. Now I'll have everything inside in the description below. But again, this is for Windows 7 and above. So I would use this command prompt here. But however, if you guys have anything that's uh, prior to Windows 7, if you have um, uh, like, like Windows XP or Windows 2000 or uh, Millennium or whatnot, what you want to do is you want to go to a different path. What you do is you type in CD, it stands for change directory, and then type in restore, S, restore, and now it's going to change the directory inside the system 32 to system re system32 slash restore and from here you want to go ahead and type in that um, that uh, exe file dot exe oops exe then you would push enter okay but for me I don't have uh, I have Windows 7 so let me just move back up a directory and I'll just type in uh, R E S T R U the exe now I'm gonna push enter okay here we go okay now here we are uh, resource system files and settings okay what you do is you click on next okay now from here if you guys don't uh, these are these, these are my resource points here now if you guys don't have one um, try this show more resource points click on this and what you want to do is you want to click one of these that's uh, prior to you getting infected with that ransomware 
And um, the thing is, if you if you guys don't have anything, uh, what you can do is, uh, if you have a rescue disc, you can pop the rescue disc in there and push F8, and um, you'll be able to go forward with that. Now, remember, now, this, this system restore is not going to work for everybody. It's going to work for most of you, though, okay? So, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to put in a restore point here from the 23rd, and I'm going to click on Next. And then you get this message here. Confirm your restore point. Uh, now the thing is, <clears throat> take note that the, re the this restore point is going is not going to delete any files or uh, videos or photos or uh, or documents or anything. Basically, it's just going to get rid of all the programs that you had um, that was after this after this restore point, and hopefully removing your ransomware as well. So we go ahead and click on finished here, and yeah one. Once this is started, uh, you don't want to interrupt it, so make sure you're, if you have a laptop, your power is plugged in. And then I'm going to click on yes here. And we're going to wait a while here. Okay, finally. Wow, that took like a good like 15 minutes, but it's shutting down right now. Let me put it back on pause. Finally, it's booting back up. Okay, now I can finally log in. Now take note guys, if this didn't work for you, then what you want to do is you want to go to, uh, you want to go back further in your restore point if you have one. If you don't, then, um, you know, hopefully you have a, a rescue disc laying around. And if this worked for you, um, you know, comment, give me a like, subscribe, that would be great as well. If you have questions or anything, just comment below. And uh, I know about, pff, there's literally like another like, 50 different ways you can uh, get rid of these ransomwares as well. But of course it's going to take a lot of time and a lot of patience. Okay, great. And there we go. System restore. Okay, it says uh, system restore completed successfully. The system has been restored to January 23rd. Perfect. Uh, and again, if this guy's helped you out, please give me a like, subscribe. And again, any questions, uh, just uh, comment below. Thanks. Have a good day. Bye.